How's it going y'all? Pete here, one of the many folks involved with the decentralized copblock.org. Just wanted to share a few thoughts on Stormcloud's gathering video called The Terrifying Future of the United States. Things that are pointed out in this video, the rights violations happening and this uh, tyrannical, uh, all these tyrannical programs and things are done by individuals, but they're acting according to perverse incentives of the institution of government or the state, police, military, things like that. They are the teeth of this bad idea called the state or government. And without those enforcers, without people um, acting according to man-made legislation, you know, these issues would not exist. Stormcloud's gathering use of law. This law was passed. This law gave these, gives these people the power. The law that's cited is merely legislation. And legislation is man-made and it's arbitrary. And passing this legislation doesn't give any person or group of people any more rights or any anything that they this group of people claims to then have this ability and they don't have that ability unless you or I grant it. Stormcloud's Gathering pointed out that it's not uncommon for these nation states, these criminal organizations that call themselves governments, to slip into tyranny. I would actually uh, put forth that they, they're founded on tyranny, they're founded on double standards, thus you know they've always existed in tyranny, it's just to what extent. So what we're seeing today with this massive growth of this uh, tyrannical regime uh, is is its natural consequence. We do live at a pretty pivotal time, I think, and I would really encourage you to realize and internalize the difference that you can make as one person, both for yourself, uh, so you act according to your own conscience, you know, irregardless of, of what uh, repercussions someone might say can or will be imposed upon you, uh, because if you fail to do so, you know, you don't you might have regrets later on and you know what kind of world do you want to leave future generations